Okay, hello and welcome to DTW Test Prep. All right, so we have a sat math question here and it's under the topic exponents, okay? So it says here, if three raised to power two plus X is equal to Y, then what is the value of three X in terms of Y? All right, so we're looking for the value of three X. So it means we're gonna have something like three X is equal to y something something it can either be any of these options okay so we have to simplify this i hope you remember your laws of exponents okay if you don't um uh i think there'll be some materials on our website which you could check that would help you out okay so here now let's go here so we have here 3x plus 2 equal to y Remember, what this means is, okay, in your exponents, it's a 3 in parentheses x plus 2, which is also the same thing as 3x, all right, are you with me, a multiplication sign, 3 raised to power 2. Okay, I hope you remember this, where you bring 3 and you, um, you remember the law of when you have the same uh, base. When you have the same base multiplying, there are powers we add, okay? The same base multiplying. This dot means what? Multiplication, okay? At the middle here. The same base multiplying, there are powers we add up. I hope you remember that particular law. And when it's division, there are powers you subtract their powers, all right? So we have three um uh multiply, multiplied by also three x uh, three raised to power two it's going to give you what y so you know our answer is to get make three x uh the value you know in terms of y so three x will be equal to whatever is on this side so what do we do if we want to cancel out this because we just need only three x to be standing on our, the left hand side of the equation so this is multiplication. So it means that to cancel this out, we have to divide both sides by three raised to power two, divide by three raised to power two. So this would cancel out and we're left here with what? Three raised to power X is equal to Y. What is three raised to power two? That will give us what? Nine, so over nine. So this will be our answer. Okay, so this will be the value of three X in terms of Y. So our right option here is option D. Okay, don't forget to please subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you have any problem, join our Facebook group. The link is in the video description box of this video. Okay, join the Facebook group, you know, um, drop your questions on the group and you will receive solutions to it. If you're interested in online tutoring, do contact us. We also have group tutoring where we charge $50 monthly. Okay, so you can also join our group group tutoring where we do three times a week monday wednesdays friday all right eastern time all right so and you can join us for that and it's 50 dollars a month if you want one-on-one -on -one tutoring you can also contact me all right so thank you and stay tuned don't forget finally that jesus christ is coming soon please do give your life to christ for he's the way he's the truth and is the life and it's the one who's going to lead us to heaven at last and also give us peace here on earth. Okay, whichever troubles we're going through, you know, just come to him. Give him that body, okay? And he will see you through. Just give everything to him with everything you're struggling with, finances, any addiction, anything, depression, anything you're struggling with, come to Jesus and he has the solution for you. All right, so thank you and see you in our next video. Don't forget that you're destined to win in life. All right, and also in your forthcoming SAT exams. All right, thank you and see you in our next video.